All right, here's another option uh, for the prop savers. Um, I've had a few people s s tell me that uh, the prop saver is not a very good idea, and this is something else that uh, I want to give it a try. So, what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to put this on one on with z zip ties, and basically what you do is you take your prop saver below and you wrap your zip tie around the prop saver and over top the prop. I haven't cut these off yet. I just wanted to leave them on there so so that you could see. So I'm going to trim this off here and here and so it'll just sit on top of the prop saver so it'll be easy to change and it'll still uh, if it's a really bad hit it'll, it'll break the prop but it'll probably break the zip ties before it bends the motor. So this is the uh, regular prop saver with the o-ring so I'm going to leave a couple of them with o-rings and see how they stand up because this thing will take a hit if it crashes anyways it, I'm not really that worried about it and I'm going to run at least one with just these zip ties like this on the prop saver just so you get an idea of what I'm doing here and they're really nice and rigid there's no no movement there at all can't even rock it. So once I trim these little wings off, um, it'll be exactly the same on both sides and should be just fine. So we're going to try that as a little experiment. Okay, thanks.